Welcome to LexisNexis webinars. We offer a full annual programme of over 200 webinars covering 27 legal and tax practice areas. We're going to spend the next couple of minutes running through the key features of our webinar platform to help you get the most out of your subscription. Our webinars are audio video broadcasts delivered by leading subject matter experts, which provide a convenient way of keeping your legal and tax knowledge up to date and meeting the training requirements set by your regulator. Let's start by logging in. My username is my email address and I can find my password in the joining email that I received. Now that I am logged in, I can see my profile feature at the top right and the login box is labelled Log Out. Now let's search the library for available webinars. There are two main ways of doing this. Firstly, I can hover over either the legal or tax heading in the menu bar to bring up a full list of the topics that we cover. If I select employment from this list, I will be taken to the landing page for this topic. From this page, I can scroll down and select from this list of on-demand webinars that are available. The second way to find the relevant webinar content is via the search bar. I can simply type in a term that I'm looking for and hit return. I then select the webinar I'm interested in from the list of search results. Now that I have found the webinar I am interested in, I can find out more about it before I decide to view it. Below the webinar title there is a description of the topics that will be covered in it. Below this is a short video preview. If I scroll down further, there are biographies of the speakers. Below this are a range of supporting materials that I can download, which include copies of the slides, reports of any cases that are referred to, and an audio podcast of the presentation. Now that I've decided I want to view the webinar, I can scroll back up the page and click on the play button. The webinar will start to play and I have a range of viewing options to choose from at the top right. I can choose to move the video to the right, or select slides only, or video only. I can also make the video go full screen by clicking on the arrow icon at the bottom right of the video pane. I can press the escape key to revert back to the previous view. I can also navigate within the webinar itself by clicking on the progress bar within the video pane or by scrolling through the slide carousel at the foot of the player and select the slide that I want to navigate to. Once I've viewed the webinar, I can also take a short multiple choice quiz to reinforce my understanding of the content. There are 10 questions and I will need to answer seven of those correctly to pass. I have two attempts to do this. Finally, as I progress through the training year, I can review my learning activities by visiting the My Profile area of the site. Here, I can export the Excel spreadsheet listing the webinars that I have viewed and the quizzes that I have taken. To do this, I need to select the relevant year to the right of the Learning Summary heading and click on the Export button. So you should now have a good idea of how to get the most out of your webinar subscription. Each webinar is available to view on demand for up to two years from its release. With a library of over 500 to choose from, you should find plenty that are relevant to your area of work. Thank you for watching.